Yo, Yo dudes. dudes! Welcome to Spaghetti Ali Oli! So this is a simple traditional Italian dish that's so simple. It's actually the most simple one ever. There's, it's like garlic and olive oil, and it is quite high in oil, but it's very, very simple, it's very tasty, it's a great entry level dish, and we are going to cook it in five minutes. So, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, hold on to your hats, and here we go! Woo! So five minutes, okay. So we got a pot of water boiling away, it's on a high heat. And as it said in Italy, never put past in unless the water is actually boiling. Yes, and I have a pinch of salt in there. So we are using some whole wheat pasta, AKA whole wheat noodles. Yeah, noodles actually cook quicker. We're cooking this in five minutes, so we're using whole wheat noodles. We have 200 grams, that's Excuse four Excuse me to any Italians out there. It's yeah. just that we're cooking this in five minutes, and if we use pasta, it would take nine to 11 minutes. So I have nine cloves of garlic. I'm gonna just chop them That's fine. actually six oh, cloves six, of garlic. Sorry, sorry, I'm struggling to count today. But uh, just chop them kind of as finely as you prefer. I'm, you can see I'm not chopping them that finely. Pan on a high heat. In goes a lot of oil. Yeah, well, about six tablespoons. So it might seem like a lot of oil, obviously reduce it if you're kind of worried about calories, but this is based in a traditional Italian style, aglioli. Aglioli, aglioli. aglioli. Okay, so six tablespoons of oil into the pan. One, two, three, four, five. Good God, that's six tablespoons of oil. Wow. So next well, step, we're gonna put the lot. garlic in and the garlic's gonna kind of shallow fry in it really, if you will. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. I like it kind yeah, of a bit chunky. In it. Okay, we'll leave it a little chunky. So it's a nice covering of oil there. Okay, in goes our... So it's a really complicated recipe. So just to recap, pasta, boiling water. Wow, it's bubbling away there. Garlic in pan, cook. Okay, Tough man. one. Is there heat there? It is there now. Okay, nice, a little bit slow. Uh, we're gonna take this moment just to introduce to us, we have some exciting news. Uh, our new book is just on pre-order, so this is, we reckon, our best book to date. This is our third book. Uh, it's called Recipes for Happiness. It's, um, it's I next guess, level. 100 Three. simple recipes, all vegan, and um, yeah, it's really available to pre-order, we'll put a link down below. And we've got a full section on happiness, which is really cool, which I've been, uh, yeah, that was the nice bit, I want to write a full book on that. Like. Yeah, that's the bit I like, anyway. Uh, anyway, uh, anyway, it's a, there's a link below if you're interested in it, please do pre-order. We're going to do some promotions about it and all sorts of things, yeah. so. It's not out till May. Uh, anyway, so there you go, garlic's bubbling away. We'll cook this way. So meanwhile, we're using a herb of choice. So typically it's a flat parsley used in an alioli, um, yeah. but basil also goes really well as well. So. so I'm gonna cook this garlic. Once it starts to heat up, I'm gonna knock it down to low heat because we want it in a gentle low heat. And we do want to cook until it starts to gold, but not brown. Yeah, beautiful, good top tip, thanks. So that's really it, we adding salt or anything? Not to the garlic, no. Well, okay. It's really simple. This is pretty... Uh... Oh, this one goes great. Well, we shot a video for a vegan Parmesan. Uh, it was very good. I did want to try and make it before this, but we ran out of time. So we've, we're using a vegan cheese of choice. But it's really good. There's a link here to uh, vegan Parmesan. It's like a... We shot it with a friend, Judy Paya. Very good. Well, we're trying. Simple yeah. and genuinely taste cheesy in Parmesan. Yeah. Okay, so we're using flat parsley. We've got vegan cheese. Another essential ingredient which we're going to use is... Le chili. Chili flakes. So I think they go great in it. I think in typical alioli, it's pepper flakes, but uh, these are just chili pepper flakes. So. Yeah, well, we have pink peppercorns we put through as well. Okay, let's see how the pasta's gone. How are we doing time-wise? There's not that much stress in this one because it's very straightforward. So this one minute 43, so we're looking pretty good. We're cruising. This is, as I said, this is the simplest Italian recipe you could do. Um, if you could leave a comment, we're, we're kind of debating there, we're, we're mapping out content for the next while. If you can leave a comment and let us know what's your favorite recipe or what kind of vegan recipe you'd like us to do, because we're mapping out content for the next few months and we'd love your input, because these videos are for you, really. Yeah, so. absolutely. And whether you prefer vlogs, whether you prefer dessert, mains, whether you want to kind of more, what you kind of have enjoyed or what you, you know, all of that type of thing. Yep. So, okay, have we got a minute left? Yeah, we're looking pretty good. Okay, minute left. Okay, pasta is most likely done. I want it al dente, so that's been in for four minutes boiling away. I'm knocking it off on a high heat. I'm going to drain it over here. So I'm literally going to drain it. And, and then don't rinse it too much because we want to keep a bit of that starchy water. I'm draining so it and I'm going to go straight. I think we'll add it straight into the other pan. We'll add it straight into the pan. Yeah, I'm going to go straight in here. Because a bit of the pasta water is just going to help create more just a little bit more of a kind of almost creaminess with the oil. It'll create a, a minor emulsion. So it's off the heat now, so I'm gonna knock it off the knock heat. It off the heat. We're gonna add in, we're gonna decorate it with a little bit of parsley. And you go with a generous pinch of salt. 
because generally pasta or any kind of starch like that can take quite a decent pinch of I'm salt. I'm a massive fan of chili flakes, so obviously if you don't like it spicy, leave it out. But I just find they just add such a depth to this dish, they really bring it to the next level. And finally, just before serving, I think this goes really, really well. I'm gonna knock it off the heat now. Just crack a little uh, pink, pink peppercorns. Pink peppercorns, they just help lift it and give a nice pop of color. Not and essential, but purely just really nice. And pink peppercorn are actually quite sweet. And oh, time crumb. is done, beautiful! We put a little bit of vegan cheese. A vegan cheese on top. Okay, dude, so you go spaghetti alioli in five minutes. Next level. Really simple, the garlic's nice. goldened up. And pretty much two or three of those minutes was standing around chatting, so it's very, very simple. Mm. Brilliant. Wow. So lovely. Garlic, garlic, garlic. And a bit of salt and jam. Um, dude, there you have it, spaghetti alio in five minutes. Really simple, easy, very tasty. If you've never cooked before, it's a great place to start. Yeah, very simple, tasty, delicious. If you can use whole wheat noodles, it just make it higher in fiber and a little bit better for you. Yeah, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching. Sending loads of love. Bye.